Good morning. This morning I just got a new software update. We got 2019 12.1.1, .1 .1, third digit. Uh, a little bit unusual. Let's take a look at the release notes and see what is new in here. So, navigate on autopilot. I already have that, so I'm not too worried about that. New software updates, here we go. So we now see the status of software updates. So if there is there a software update available, we can tap on that and actually watch the progress come down. Uh, some new games, Tesla Tari. I'll have a chance to check that out. I don't play the games very often, but it'll be kind of nice to see. Uh, possibly some updates to sentry mode. Not too worried about that because, see, on my car, whenever you use sentry mode and the dash cam, now I don't need a dash cam because I have a uh, black view here, but I found in my computer that it crashed too much. So I'm in the habit here. I turn off the dash cam. I don't use it. Sentry mode seems to work fine now. So I think it's just taxing my computer too much because I have the older MCU one. All right. Uh, some changes here to the dash cam. Uh, nothing really out of the ordinary. Ah, here we go. On route battery warm up. So whenever you navigate to a supercharger station, your vehicle will intelligently heat the battery to ensure you arrive at the optimal temperature to charge, reducing the average charge rate times by 25%. That's a welcome thing because I use the superchargers when I go on longer trips. Additional language support. So we have some new languages for uh, navigation and stuff. So you can set it to Spanish or French, whatever. So that's good for those of you who... Uh, want to use that otherwise uh, previous release notes not much has changed i still have dog mode so there you go so that's uh, what the new 12.1.1 uh, .1 <laughs> release notes are all about um if i find anything extra i'll let you know in a subsequent video talk to you soon see ya